One of the main things that people don't realize when they look at the penalty chart for DUI is that there are many non-judicial consequences of a DUI. If you put a DUI on your history, for example, and you're going to try to get a job in a high security clearance situation, something that may require you to go on to military bases, you're probably not going to qualify for that job because they're going to find it in the national computer showing that you had this offense, and they just don't permit that. The other thing is if you're going to work for the type of business that has a company car, let's say you're going to work for a pharmaceutical sales rep or a medical appliance type thing like uh, artificial knees or joints, which are high dollar jobs, they typically screen and do not permit applicants to get past the driver's license test if you have a DUI. You can have most anything else, but they're not going to permit a DUI because they're worried about liability, especially drug companies that have pharmaceutical reps out there that they don't think would look too good going to trial if they had a prior DUI when they were hired and then maybe got in an accident and hurt someone or killed them. So this is going to be a block to many, many jobs down the road, and that's not a criminal consequence, that's a non-judicial consequence to a DUI.